prepared to ask, who gives this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I. Would you give your flowers to your maid of honor? Take each other by your hands. Corey, do you take Anna as your lawful wife to walk beside her when things are good and when things are bad? Do you pledge to her your undying love and constant faithfulness? All you have or hope to have, do you give to her as your life partner? Do you pledge to her your help, support, love, and prayers? And do you pledge to remain faithfully hers until death separates you? Anna, do you take Corey as your lawful husband to walk beside him when things are good and when things are bad? Do you pledge to him your undying love and constant faithfulness? All you have or hope to have, do you give to him as your life partner? And do you pledge to him your help, support, love, and prayers? And do you pledge to remain faithful until death separates you? What tokens do you have in commemoration of this pledge? Corey, I take this ring and place it on the third finger of Anna's left hand. Do you give this ring to Anna as a visible symbol of your vows and your love for her? I do. Then repeat after me. This ring, this ring. I give to you. I give to you. As a promise of keeping, as a promise of keeping my vows and loving you, and loving you today, tomorrow, and as long as we shall live. Today, tomorrow, and as long as we shall live. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Anna, take that ring, place it on the third finger. Corey's left hand. Do you give this ring to Corey as a symbol of your love and vows that you've made to him today? Then repeat after me. This ring I give to you as a promise of keeping my vows and loving you today, tomorrow, and so long as we shall live. In Jesus' name, amen. And now having pledged your love and loyalty to each other and having sealed the pledge with the marriage rings, I do by the authority vested in me as a minister in the church of the living God and in conformity with the laws of the state of Georgia pronounce you husband and wife. Corey and Anna, you're no longer two independent persons, but you are now one in the eyes of the Lord. And what God has joined together, let no man separate. He may kiss the bride. All right. Step out there, let me. It is my joy and pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Corey Tripp.